UMass Boston softball continuing their spring break trip down in South Carolina, trying to build off an earlier walk-off win against Keystone College, taking on McDaniel College in the second game of the day. And the Beacons getting on the board first again, like they have been doing pretty much all of the trip. Haley Tilbury with a double to start things off. And then after that, Sydney Sandin is going to drive her home with an RBI double. That would be the first of three hits on the afternoon for Sandin. The Beacons ahead, one to nothing. But the Green Terror would come back and score two runs of their own. It would be because of Beacon errors. The Lauren Miners error right here allows the runner to reach base in Peyton Hazelton. And then later on, Mandy Butts is going to end up grounding out to Jordan Toomey at first. Run scores were tied up at one all. Moving on to the third inning, Bella Sylvester is going to reach first on the throwing error. Katie Newton's going to score on that error, and McDaniel College takes a 2-1 to one lead. But the Beacons come back in a big way. Eight unanswered runs in this one, starting off with Lauren Bathia. She reaches first on a fielding error. That was one of five errors for the Green Terror in this game. It's 2-2. Two two. Caitlin Sawyer follows it up. With an RBI single to left field, Bathia scores. The Beacons in front now, 3-2. to two. And they continue to roll in the fifth inning. Jordan Toomey, a sacrifice fly to left field. Scores a run. The Beacons now in front, 4-2. to two. Amari English then with the big hit of the game, a three-run home run. She now has 12 RBIs on the season. She had eight RBIs all of last year. She's done all this in just Seven games down south. Beacons ahead big now, 7-2, to and they tack on a few more later on and make it an 8-2 to ball game as Lauren Miner is going to ground out to third. Sydney Sandin goes to third on the play. Sophie Richland scores. It's an unearned run due to another McDaniel College error early on in that inning, and then Richland herself reaching on an error makes it 9-2. to The Beacons win this one 9-2. to Moved to 6-1 to start the year. And Brie Melchionda nearly had a no-hitter in this game. She gives up three hits. Her first hit wasn't allowed until the first batter of the sixth inning. Three hits, two runs, one earned, nine strikeouts, and one walk. The Beacons will have an off day tomorrow before they finish out their spring break trip against Utica University and Mullenberg College on Friday afternoon.